Good evening, baseball fans. You are tuning in to Houston Astros Network, and we are here for Game 1 of the 2015 American League Championship Series between our hometown Houston Astros, who are traveling to Safeco Field to take on the interdivision rival Seattle Mariners. There you see Bo Porter, the skipper of the Houston Astros, and the lineup that he's put together for today's matchup. Leading things off in center field will be Rafael Ortega. Batting second, playing second will be Jose Altuve. Batting third, playing first, Kendrys Morales. And in the cleanup spot will be the big bat of the DH, Chris Carter. On the mound for the Seattle Mariners, taking on that lineup will be Taiwan Walker, who went 11 and 6 with a 3.34 ERA and 197 strikeouts on the season. He had a very solid season for the young prospect. Two outs in the now, 0-1 count on Kendrys Morales. The kick and the pitch from Walker is going to be ripped in the right field, but it's right to Logan Morrison as he gloves it and puts it away for the final out of the top of the first inning. We'll be right back here in Houston Astros Network. Welcome back to Houston Astros Network. There you see the manager of the Seattle Mariners and his lineup for today's matchup. Leading things off in center field will be Denard Spann. Batting second, playing shortstop is Willie Bloomquist. Batting third, playing second is Robinson Cano. And in the cleanup spot will be the first baseman, Justin Smoke. On the mound for the Astros, opposing that lineup will be the right-hander, Jared Cozart, who went 15-9 in the regular season with a 3.09 ERA, only giving up 74 in runs, and 147 strikeouts. He had a very solid season, and that is why he was the number one starter throughout the regular season. Working with a 2-0 count on Cano with two outs leaning. The kick, and the pitch from Cozart is given a ride into deep left field. That's going to get back to the track, and a step in front of the wall. Mike O'Neill gloves it, and he puts it away for the third out of the first inning, as we are still scoreless in this one. We'll be right back here at Houston Astros Network. Welcome back to Houston Astros Network. Cozart working on the ex-Astro, Jason Castro with two outs. Here comes the pitch, and that's going to be lined down the third base line, and it gets under the glove of Todd Frazier. That's going to be a base hit for Jason Castro. They're looking to get something started here with two outs in the inning. 1-2 count now on the DH, Wilson Bedemit. Cozart getting set. Here's the kick and the pitch, and that's also going to be lined down the third baseline past Todd Frazier. And the Astro and the Mariners have got something brewing here with two outs, as they've got runners on first and second in Jason Castro and Wilson Bedemy. 3-1 count now on Logan Morrison. The kick and the pitch from Cozart is taken for a ball, and that's going to load the bases for the Mariners as Jared Kozar has gotten himself into a serious two-out jam here. Base is loaded. 2-2 count on Julio Morbon, the Rookie of the Year. The kick and the pitch is grounded to second baseman Altuve. He feels this one, fires the first, and they do get out of the inning. Jared Kozar works himself into a two-out jam, but he works his way out of it as well. And we are still scoreless here at the end of two. We'll be right back here at Houston Astros Network. Welcome back to Houston Astros Network. One out in the inning. Cozart working on Cano with a runner on first. The pitch, and that's going to be lined in the right field in front of George Springer. He feels it, fires the third, but the runner is going to be holding up at second. And we've got one out. Runners on first and second for the Mariners. And now we've got a 2-2 count on Justin Smoke. The pitch from Cozart is going to be ripped in the right field, but George Springer puts it away. And the runner does not want to contest Springer's arm as the runners hold up. First and second once again, two outs. 2-1 two count on Kyle Seeger. The pitch from Cozart is swung on, and it's going to be given a ride in the deep right field. That's back, but it's to the track as George Springer makes the catch about two steps in front of the wall. 
And that's going to be how the third inning ends. We are still scoreless, and we'll be right back here in Houston Astros Network. Welcome back to Houston Astros Network. We are here with two outs and a 3-0 count on Logan Morris, and the pitch from Cozart is taken for a ball down in the zone. And that's a four-pitch at bat, four-pitch walk for Logan Morrison. Next batter up is Julio Morbon, the AL Rookie of the Year. The kick and the pitch from Cozart is lined up the middle past the diving glove of Hiroki Nakajima. And the Mariners have got themselves a two-out rally going on as they've got runners on first and second. And they're trying to get something going here. And the Astros are not going to let Cozart try to work his way out of this one as they bring in Eddie Butler, the young right-hander, who's appeared in two games with a 1-0 record and a 1.93 ERA with 4.2 innings pitched and four strikeouts so far in the playoffs. A very solid stat line right there for the young right-hander. 1-2 count here on Denard Span. The kick and the pitch from Butler is lined up the middle. Rafael Ortega is going to miss this one in center field. It's going to get up against the wall. Run run's going to come around for the Mariners. Two runs are going to come around. And Denard Span has himself a two-out, two-RBI triple. To give, the, to give the Mariners a 2-0 lead here in the bottom of the fourth inning. And now Willie Bloomquist steps in. The pitch from Butler is going to be grounded softly to Jose Altuve. He fires the first. And the Astros finally get themselves out of the inning after allowing a two-out jam from Jared Cozart as the Mariners strike for two as they take a 2-0 lead. We'll be right back here in Houston Astros Network. Welcome back to Houston Astros Network. We are here in the top of the fifth. 2-1 cat and one out. George Springer at the plate. The pitch from Walker is given a ride opposite field. That's going to get back, and it just carries over the wall. That's a solo shot from George Springer. Call it a Springer dinger. As Springer rounds the bases, and he makes this a one-run ball game. Scores now 2-1. Mariners still in the lead. But with the heart of the Astros lineup up, this is a very scary situation for the Mariners. The pitch from Walker is going to give you a ride in the right center field from Todd Frazier. And that's also out of here. That's back-to-back -back shots for the Houston Astros. And they have already got themselves back in this one. Is it a tie ball game now? It is 2-2 now in the top of the fifth inning. Runners on first and second for the Astros. 1-1 count on Rafael Ortega. Walker getting set. The kick. And the pitch is going to be grounded into left field. And the fielder's going to have some trouble with it as Morbon has trouble and Nakajima is going to come around to score. And that is now a 3-2 lead for the Astros as they rebounded quite quickly after giving up a 2-0 lead. Now Altuve steps in for the Strohs. Walker getting set. Here comes the pitch. And that's going to be granted to Kyle Seager at third. He takes the short way at second. And that's how the top of the fifth wraps up. But not before the Astros strike for three. After the Mariners struck for two. And it is now a 3-2 to two Astros lead. We'll be right back here in Houston Astros Network. Welcome back to Houston Astros Network. We are in the bottom of the ninth inning as the left-hander Sean Doolittle, who's appeared in two games, gotten two saves with a 5.40 ERA. He's going to come in to close this one out for the Astros. Facing Willie Bloomquist, 2-2 two -two count. The kick and the pitch is going to be chopped into foul territory as Morales catches this one and puts that one away for the first stat of the ninth inning. They are two outs away from sealing game one of the ALCS. Robinson Cano, 1-2 count. The kick and the pitch from Doolittle is swung through the fastball. Robinson Cano goes down swinging. And the Astros are now one out away from taking a 1-0 lead in the series. 1-2 count on Justin Smoke. The pitch from Doolittle is swung through the down and away changeup. And Sean Doolittle strikes out two. As the Astros come away with the win. As that is how the cookie crumbles. And the Astros take a 1-0 lead in the series over their interdivision rivals, the Seattle Mariners. We'll head down to the field now for our tops player of the game in Eddie Butler. He came in, pitched four and a quarter innings of relief, only gave up six hits, and struck out three as he kept the lead for the Astros as he had a very solid relief performance in this one. And with that being said, we'll wrap things up here at this ball game at Safeco Park. Don't forget to take a look at the box score on your way out, and also, don't forget to tune in next time 
here on Houston Astros Network for Game 2 of the 2015 American League Championship Series. Leave this one alone She could tell right away That I was back 